goes on. Fakes the pitch and Plumley takes it straight ahead. He's got a first down and plenty more. Here's a world-class speed from John Rice Plumley, And it's a rip of 53. That's the reason he trotted out there first tonight for Ole Miss at quarterback. Longest play of the season for Ole Miss. And now pressure and Plumley gets dropped. But they don't adjust. They expect a quick throw here. Only three rush and they still get to him. Second straight sack. That time it's Andre Mintz. And that one's good. Been looking to get the ball to coming in motion. And nothing to him there. They get behind the line of scrimmage to take down Vaughn. Plumley's first start was last week against Bama. Hands it off this time. They need just one for the first down. And they pick up two. Yeah, I don't know if the Kansas people really like me that much. Now to the near side. Plumley in zone. Touchdown. Hello, speed. Of the screen, Kalija Lipscomb, my veteran receiver on a true freshman. Something was off there. Lipscomb won in the same area code. DeAndre Prince had the coverage. I mean, last week, but got to continue to find ways to get Elijah Moore involved. Five wide here, and that's complete to Elijah Moore, and he's got an Ole Miss first down. First completion for John Rice Plumley. Two sports standout coming from Hattiesburg. Takes a bump, keeps on going, looking for a block downfield. And Plumley will lay off the gas and take it out of bounds. On a quarterback draw, Plumley gets hit before he can get to the line of scrimmage. Still able to fight forward and only loses one. Bryce Plumley fires complete. Let's go down the sideline. And those who came before me, I'm just truly honored to be going in and represent Brewston, represent Ole Miss. Big run for Keyshawn Vaughn a moment ago. Second and four for Neal. And that one's complete for a first down. It's Kalijah Lipscomb who spins free. He's got a blocker. And Kalijah Lipscomb's going to take it deep into Ole Miss territory. Neal, flush from the pocket, will take it to the 10. Back to the inside, and he's inside the 5. What a heady run for Riley Neal. It picks up 17 on the season. And he pokes it through. They'll go for it on fourth and three. Incomplete. Vandy able to turn him over on downs. It's Randall Haney with another pass breakup. Slant routes working up top. This is not a bad ball. The ball is accurate. But Haney had a jump on it and was there before the receiver. Downfield. And Plumlee's not doing it. Pinkney open over the middle for a quick moment. Now it's Keyshawn Vaughn underneath. And Vaughn will turn it upfield and turn it into a 15-yard gain. Four-man rush. Neal over the middle. What a grab! Fantastic catch by Bresnahan, who just entered for Pinckney. Boots this one through. And Riley Gay with a pair of field goals to count for the Vandy offense in the first half. Yeah, I'd be frustrated chasing this guy around all day. Look at this play. They get the handoff off. And it turns into a first down and play more for Jerry and Ely. He turned down Major League Baseball to come to Oxford. And it has paid off a touchdown run of 78 yards. As the third quarter ticks away. Vaughn loses two. Vision there. Not to get outside the pocket and force the throw. Use your legs when plays break down. Here's Snoop Connor. Bring your green hat. We're going streaking. Snoop Aloof, 84 yards. Here comes pressure from the edge. They go that direction to Lipscomb. And they got him by Shoelace. It's a loss of three. Miles Hartsfield kick in, and that injury being, ends up being a lot worse on Sunday. Yeah. So we'll see how available he is and how his mobility. Third down, nine. Pressure. Neal wheels out of there. And he flicks it to the sideline. Trust is being truthful. Four-man rush. And that one on the 
hip. Jalen Julius to clean it up. Jared Pinkney there. Wallace has it batted down. Mississippi making plays. See. Some guys who could run in this offense with legit track speed. Vandy coaches, they fake the reverse. Vandy coaches compared him to Christian. Like, no, she can't draw near this well. She just walks around here and stares at me. <laughs> She's only human. That pass is incomplete. He wants to throw it. And over the shoulder catch made. Started, of course, on signing day with his fantastic freshman class. Bounce to the outside. Scotty Phillips is in the end zone. Touchdown, Ole Miss. He did at Florida for his opportunity. The competition was opened last year. He tears his ACL in practice. Feel for him. It's unbelievable. I feel for the guy. Time where he was thinking about transferring away from Manville High School, and his mom said, no, no. You, you don't transfer just because things aren't working out, but you're going to stick it out. Texas, Texas Tech. Tech. <laughs> Pressure on Deuce Wallace. And a nice grab downfield by Chris Pierce. Crunched. Likely the last play of the game, fourth and long. Wallace goes underneath. And Keon Brooks gets cut down. A dominating performance for Ole Miss on both sides of the ball. They rack up 415 yards on the ground. They hold Vandy to just 62 yards rushing. Yeah. Ole Miss goes to three and three. Vandy drops to one and four in the season. Rebels are halfway to a bowl at the midway point of their schedule.